Hey folks, welcome back to Winging It. Like, subscribe, share, and follow. Hey, uh, you got army worms, so. give you a look at those I did a bucket test which is pretty simple you just take a little bit of dish soap and a bucket and I got like a three gallon uh, there's a cat litter bucket that I've been using but it's a little bit of dish soap and you dump it down there and watch the worms come out um, I saw one a couple weeks ago so I treated the front yard here and uh, there's no army worms in this um, I only saw one up here couple weeks ago so I treated it with uh, just an ortho bug be gone that worked obviously worked because there aren't any in it but on my side yards here you can see down there I got a couple sections that are not doing so hot so I went ahead and I did the bucket test over here on this side and I really haven't been watering this but there is a few in there um, they really like water, watered ground, nice soft ground, so keep an eye out for that. All right, and then this is the side where I've really found a lot of them. If you can see here, it's starting to get a little of that brown crusty, and then right down in there, it's getting kind of that uh, hue, that grayish hue to it. You see how it's... Well, darker green back here and then it starts getting light and some dead stuff going on in there well I just did a bucket test and uh, I got army worms so they've made their way to northern Iowa you can see one right in there I got one right there they're smaller than I thought they'd be these are only like uh, three quarters of an inch long the ones I was seeing online they're like they seem to be inch inch and a half long and nice and thick but yeah so I did this uh, bucket test and I got uh, army worms in this spot I thought I had them coming in the front yard and I actually treated the front so um, I did the buck test there and there wasn't so on this side I've been keeping it wet and they like wet ground so Guess I gotta treat it. These things do get pretty good sized. This one here is about two inches long that I don't know if this uh, dish soap kills them or what because they really don't like it and then they quit moving like that I don't know it's interesting so now that I know I have the worms and there's quite a few of them actually what am I going to use to get rid of it um, I just went out and I bought a off the shelf it's a uh, ortho bug be gone it's a granule so be easy to apply and I just did the I just read the directions and put it down on the front and it worked really well out here so I just I just went and did that on the sides just now as you can see here this is the label um, I just used the lowest number um, it's got bifenthrin in it which is a good bug killer you can get that in the liquid too it's a lot cheaper as a liquid but this was still only like 10 bucks or so um, the way the label reads, if you put this stuff down in the early summer, it'll last six months. So I might do that next year. I don't know. Um, you put it down heavier, of course. But at the low rate, it says this will cover 16,000 square feet. So that'd get me by for three years. Yeah, sorry about the uh, little sign there. We had a garage sale, and I don't want to sell all my good stuff here. A little simple one, and my... Green County Ferts. 
But anyways, guys, I had success using that. Uh, just off the shelf, regular box store uh, granule, and uh, works well for me, and it should work well for you. Just be sure to read your labels and throw her down. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.